mambo vipi mwana SNS popote pale ambapo unatufuatilia karibu sana mimi naitwa Frederick Bundala Skywalker na kwenda kuzungumza na warembo wawili hawa wana mambo mazito mazuri makubwa ambayo wanayafanya na ungependa kushia na wewe uh, anaitwa Lakisha ambaye nimekuwa introduce naye hivi karibuni tuna Mima ambaye Mima nimekuwa nikimfuatilia kwa muda sasa au sio lakini Mima haya anaishi nchini Denmark Mima mambo vipi Poa poa Uh, wakati tunawasiliana nikawa nahisi uko Denmark kumbe uko nchini kimya kimya. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Maana hata uposti kwamba uko uh, Tanzania. Ah alikuwa na posti um, uko location lakini. No, si location. Uh-huh. No, no. Kwa nini? Ah hata siji wala sifikiri hivyo, yani mimi na posti tu. Vibes, yeah, good uh-huh. things. Okay. <laughs> Ni so, nilicho kigundua Ah uh, wenzetu bwana wanaokaa ugaibuni wakija anakuja kimya kimya anataka uh, kwa nini inakuwa hivyo kwa sababu sio peke yako <laughs> Yaani <laughs> au hawagi No <laughs> ndo tunaaga lakini ndo ile hii <laughs> trip yani kusema kweli mimi mm. nilipokuwa Denmark eh, nilikuwa na niko sana kwenye Instagram natafuta wasanii yani niko very interested na in music Okay um, Sam Kamona lakisha nikasema he huyu mshana mbona she's so talented mm. nikam repost actually okay vile kum repost kaona sasa ma producer wa Denmark wako interested yani huyu ni nani anatoka wapi nikaona there's something here mm. yeah na hii trip ya hapa nilikuwa ile faster faster tu okay yeah Oh interesting yes. interesting mimi wakati na na nawapokea nikadhani nyinyi mmefahamiana kitambo labda mm. wewe ni umesoma <laughs> dadake jirani au connection yote kumbe ni kupitia mitandao yes okay yes. kwa hiyo yes. kwa muda gani mmefahamiana tangu hiyo itokee okay. mm-hmm. mima nani uh, uh, lakisha uh, lakisha alijibu hili mwezi sasa mwezi ya inaenda mwezi ya sogea kidogo hapa inaenda mwezi nao tunge tufahamiane okay mbona mwanakana like chemistry yenu ni kubwa kiasi ambacho ina, inaonekana kama mmefahamiana miaka kumi mitano iliyopita mimi nafikiri itakuwa tu ni fake. Mm. Yaani mm. kama kama ilikuepo yani unajua kama Mungu amefanya tu kwa sababu ni automatic na tumekuta tuna vibe Mm. kila kitu tunafanya kazi vizuri ili iko kama ilikuepo lakini yeah, ni yeah. Oh. Yeah. Okay, so. mm. well so uh, tutawafahamu kila mmoja vizuri zaidi lakini kitu ambacho nimekiona hapa lakisha wakati kabla tujaanze interview muone umepiga sala hapa yeah. wewe ni mtu wa, wa kusali sana inaonekana yeah. yeah, mimi ni mtu wa imani mm. na ni kitu ambacho I'm, I'm, I'm proud of okay yeah. oh yeah. interesting well uh, mima Mm. Uh, jina lako jingine ni Kalisa. Kalisa. Yeah. Kalisa tuliangalia Game of Thrones tunamfahamu mama. <laughs> mama wa, wa, wa dragons wale. <laughs> Mimi na watatu, sina wawili. I have three dragons. <laughs> <laughs> okay. okay. So uh, Mima the Flower. Yeah. Ndio ndio jina lako zaidi. So wewe ni in Denmark unafanya nini? Eh uh, Denmark nafanya kazi ya social work actually. Ndio profession yangu. Uh, kusaidia watu wana difficulty mm. um, afu on the side ni event concert coordinator tunakuwa tuna invite uh, masanii wa Africa actually mm. uh, that's the main aim uh, tushakuwa na diamond uh, na Davido pia so ndio hiyo ndio hivyo music ndio lwanza ile kwa na interest now afu when i started looking at the kuni instagram don't count na oh there's so much talent in tanzania and they just need like a lot of support and i feel like yani there's space for everybody mm-hmm. so that's why u, u, wakati na fahamu account yako ya instagram mm. nilipokuwa naangalia picha mtu uh, watu wengi wana hisi wewe ni model yeah hiyo pia nafanya okay yeah <laughs> picha yako nimeiona sehemu si kama nimekufananisha au vipi zile Itakuwa. picha ambazo watu naziona kwenye uh, zinanunuliwa mtandaoni yeah umewahi kufanya hizo nyingi yeah yeah actually nilikuwa siku moja nilikuwa naenda wapi kule center moja sasa sikumbuki ipi nikaingia nikaona picha yangu pia hapa hapa mjini yeah 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 hapa hapa oh. mimi city yeah mimi yeah. city yeah. okay yeah. okay yeah yeah, yeah. 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 Na, na, na of course naziona instagram tena yeah. makampuni hapa hapa nyumbani <laughs> Kwa hiyo ukijiona uki, 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 hivyo unajisikiaje? 
Ah, no, of course, now not a house. Especially in in a tumioko ne my country. Oh you yeah. Know, you want to represent something, yeah? Oh yeah. Yeah, so it's it's really nice to see. Hizo <laughs> hizo VP hizo uh, because sababu ni warembo wengi kutoka Tanzania wangependa kujua eh. una, unapataje hizo connection ni ni company ya Denmark eh, mm. wanakuwa wanapiga picha different eh, themes mm. afu wanakuwa wanaziweka kwenye website afu uh, companies zinaweza kuzinunua uh-huh. yeah okay. so i guess uh, Tanzania naona imependa Mm, na yeah. na na wewe unalipoaje? Nilipo mwanzoni pale ama inavotumika ndio unalipa? Eh mimi nalipo mwanzoni. Aha. Yeah. Kwa hiyo ushamalizana nao. Yeah, ushamalizana. Popote utakapoona imetumika wewe hutaki kulalamika. No, no, no. Ushamalizana. Una agreement. <laughs> oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Interesting. Yeah. Everything is written. Hata so. kama ukiona benki moja ya Tanzania imekutumia same. Yeah, hivyo unajua kama ile nilivoenda pale micro chaining nikazungumza nao. Mm. At soko, nimezungumza nao na sasa hivi ndo na fanya deal nao. Okay. So nikiona sehemu nazungumza nao ni mie afu after that tunafanya kwamba kwamba sasa una deal na the real yes, person yes, ndio mimi. Yes. Yes. And that was This actually my cool. aim. Uh-huh. Eh, that was my aim. Okay. Yeah. Interesting. Yeah. So okay, sasa uh, lakisha. Yeah. By the way jina lako mbona la kimarekani sana? <laughs> mm? Actually mimi jina langu halisi ni Shakira. Shakira. Shakira mm. wa mauno ule wa Colombia. Hivyo hivyo yani. <laughs> no, ina spell tofauti na L. Ina L Shakira. Yeah. So kwa mimi kwenye mm. idea zangu za kisanii art na nini nikasema niwestaki kwenda mbali na jina langu. Kwa sababu okay. niligeuze. So then I get Lakisha. But oh. it's same. Ukiangalia ukianza kusoma nyuma unapata Shakira. Shakira. Ukianza huko oh. unapata Lakisha like tsi. You know. Okay, yeah. interesting. It's Jina zuri. <laughs> Jina zuri sana like Latin or Black American son alipenda yeah. sana ile jina. Mm-hmm. Okay. Um nime mimi alinitumia ni ngoma yako ni picha na uh, of course kipande kifupi cha video cha ngoma yako itakayotoka mwezi ujao. Yeah. I mean no 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 ta, yeah, mwezi ujao tale moja. Okay, match. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, ndo naiachia. Yes. Unaongea kuhusiana na boy next door umempenda na nini? Very good concept na video nzuri umependeza. So hii ni true story au ni, ni katika kuwakilisha mawazo ya wengi? I mean msinicheke but it <laughs> Yes, so two true story ni kitu ambacho kimetokea kwangu mimi mwenyewe. Mm-hmm. Okay. Shout out to the next to the boy next door. Si <laughs> mita gani, una show up here? Ah, excuse me. Ni mama sana. Ah, kwa hiyo ni zamani. Ah, the time at that time ya kitu unamwona wewe jamaa. Alikuwa anakaa kinyitonyama. Aha. Akachube road. Akachube, akachube sisi ndio tuko na ofisi ya yetu zamani. Wakati nipo dizi na kwa kina wema alikuwa anakaa huko zamani. Ah, lakini zamani tena. Zamani sana eh. So so uko nyumbani na huyu bwana mdogo yuko jirani. Actually alikuwa akuwa hapa Tanzania lakini ni Tanzania anajua alikuwa anasoma nje. Mm. So, alikuwa anakuja hata mara moja moja. Ana no, alikuwa haji mimi mmeona mtandaoni alafu akawa anafahamiana na rafiki yangu. Okay. Sasa so, unajua vijana wetu wakiwa Tanzania jua kali unajua anakuwa anapauka pauka. Kwa nje wapo na nganga. Sasa kama guy this is my ideal man. You know, nikae ile na wish. Na natakiwa kirudi sasa unajua ukiwa mshana bado mdogo nataka naanzia wapi sasa. Mm-hmm. Unakuwa tu na kufana maumivu yako. So nikasema why not nifanye nyimbo sasa hivi that siko kule tena mm-hmm. lakini nasema maybe kuna msichana ambaye yuko kwenye hiji yangu nao ana end up through the same thing oh, yeah. kwa nime mm-hmm. kwa, kwa hiyo ulikausha ukakana Ay, una, yeah, na yeah. upendo wako moyoni yeah, ukataka kushare naye alafu baadaye kabadilika kipindi ambacho yeye amerudi mm. nikaja kugundua kwamba alikuwa ana mchumba wake ni rafiki yake na rafiki yangu mimi eh. rafiki yake ndo ana date Oh my crush oh. so then I, the crush has to die from there because <laughs> we have to respect the friendship oh, yes, yeah. yeah so okay. then it is sharp but lakini kitu ambacho kilinchua muda mhm yeah yeah nifahamu kitu kama hicho no hajui mpaka leo hajui mpaka leo yuko yuko right like this yeah okay i guess how is you are tena kwa sababu itakubaki kuwa siri okay kwa hiyo idea ya miaka yote hiyo kaja kuwa nayo na sasa hivi ndio umeifanya kwenye wimbo yeah na ni miaka mingi kama miaka kumi sasa hivi oh so now kwa bado kadogo kabisa But then nilikuwa napenda muziki back then but now he mm. keep in nimeanza ku focus now nikasema kwa nini situmie ile idea kwa sababu kama imenitokea mimi i believe kuna mtu mwingine anatokea uh-huh. so i said let me use it yeah eh kama kuitumia well uh, mimi umeishi Denmark na tumekuwa tukiambiana kwamba ama nikisikia wasichana ama si wenyewe tunapiga story kwamba 
bwana wazungu kama mwanamke akikupenda anakuambia straight hataki kupindisha huku bongo ukimwambia msichana akikuambia anakupenda unamchukulia kama hajatulia yes. ni true story it's true it's true yani wasichana wa denmark yeah. straightforward okay yeah yani hapo hapo hey i like you let's go home <laughs> Yeah, that's how it is. <laughs> like in hapa is different. Yeah, yeah. Hapa ni ngumu sana. Especially kwa mwanamke. Oh yeah, yeah. ni ngumu sana. Kwa sababu uh, tatizo halipo tu kwenu, lipo mm. pia namna tunavyoipokea. Au sio? Hiyo yeah, ndio point. Yes, yes, yes. Kwa yeah. sababu hiyo ndio inatufanya sisi tuogope kusema. Mhm. Mm-hmm. Kwa sababu itakuumiza sana yeah. pale ambapo mtu atakutafsiri kama wewe hujatulia. Exactly. Okay, yeah. so. Kama hata kila unachokuwa umeki mm. aim kwake ukipart mm. tena. Yeah, absolutely. Yes. Kwa hiyo ni swala la kitamaduni zaidi. Yeah. Oh, see. Kwa culture, the mm-hmm. swala la culture. Mwanamke hawezi kuzungumza. Ah, yeah. yeah. Unataka usubirie tu. Sasa ndio mimi nimesubiria mpaka nimegaye. Sasa sijui usome science kwa ukishindwa kuzisoma science basi imekula kwako. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. And sometimes why inatokea uh, yule crush wako kumbe na wewe anakukubali vitu vingi. Kubali lakini hajui. Eh, so ikitokea ndo baadaye utakuta na msichana anakuambia unajua mimi niko nakupenda tangu zamani. So afu kuniambia so wako, so mid wako, afu huwezi kumwambia. Afu kingine mimi naishi wa Tanzania wanaumwa kitanzania wenyewe wanajua kwetu sisi hiyo soka culture yetu wanawake kuzungumza. Yeah sure. Mm. Uh, kuna wizi tunafanya unajua msichana anaweza kuambia hai lakini yani ukiwa sasa na wewe uelewi basi. Mhm. Ndio imetoka hiyo. Yeah, hatuwezi kusema hiyo ndio shida. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> so inabidi inabidi sisi wanaume tujifunze ku ku read, ku read the, the signs. The signs. Yeah. Otherwise msichana uh, unampenda kabisa kabisa anaweza akapokonywa hivi wakati yeah. wewe alikuwa anakupenda <laughs> lakini sasa hawezi akakwambia. Well, very interesting. So so hii ni ngoma yako ngapi? Na inaitwa hivyo hivyo. Inaitwa Boy Next Door. Boy Next Door. Yeah. Okay. Ngoma yako ngapi? Uh, ni nyimbo yangu ya pili. Mm. Yeah, ni nyimbo yangu ya pili ambayo inatoka tarehe moja. Chris amesema anakufahamu yeah. wakati huo mlikutana mlima nsite siju wewe we umemwambia kwamba ulikuwa haujazoea zoea yani bado mgeni kwenye yeah. industry ni yeah, so tu unajua siku mm-hmm. moja nilikuwa na sasa unajua kaka zetu nyinyi mko kwenye media uh-huh. industry tunawaona sana okay. kwa hivyo mwanzo kwa sababu yule ni Chris sasa namwanzia wa uh-huh. afu mimi hapo ndo kwanza nimetoa nyimbo ina hata wiki ile zone mm. alafu yani ndio inaanza kwenda kwenda kidogo kidogo eh nikasema sasa atanielewa nikamfuata nikamwambia nikajiuliza nika karibuni ichukua kama nusu saa hivi mm. kana muangalia tu na niende okay. nisiende niende akili karibia naenda nikaenda nikamwambia mambo namba interview ngo <laughs> akanikubalia uh-huh. lakini sasa so, eh, nilikuwa naanza nilikuwa na uoga oh. eh, nikaona sasa naweza nikaenda baada nikaanza kutetemeka <laughs> anyway nikasema eh, next time nikasema ngoja niendelee kufanya kazi najua tu lazima niende oh, nafikia yeah. siku siwezi ku jump tena mm-hmm. i have to yeah. and i'm here i'm feeling good Amazing. Amazing. Yeah. Uh, Mima. Kitu gani ambacho ulikiona kwa lakisha ukaamua umsaidie? Well before sijaja hapa mm. e, ile flow yake and, and second of all unajua Tanzania of course kuko female rappers but it's not that popular. Unajua na na sasa hivi ukitazama yani Marekani, Europe female rapper ndo wako on top yeah. wakina Karibi. Mm. Megan Thee Stallion yeah. so mesema why see tuko Tanzania afu tuna play music ya yeah? kimarekani wakati tuna wasanii hapa hapa wana wana rap vizuri afu wana rap Kiswahili na English is something we can relate to yeah mm-hmm. do maana okay lovo kuja hapa nikamwona yani yuko so ambitious e, na ana history kubwa sana mm. na hiyo tu we look forward to tell in the future um, ni hard working you are very hard working and she is hustling where she can and i thought why not if i have the experience nim saidie kidogo kidogo and then uh, yeah becoming her manager ah kwa hiyo sasa hivi ni manager wake yeah you can say that we okay. tru- we like we get to know each other uh, but we yes we are going there. yeah yeah uh, okay mm-hmm. uh can you track yako a boy next door how rap like him Yeah, I mean So when you rap up here? Yeah, I mean you rap na ni mzuri sana pia kwenye kuimba. Oh, mm. so na mix it's, it's good kwa hivyo pia. Yeah, yeah. Na hizo kwa hivyo ni kitu ambacho I can't help kwa sababu mimi hata nikienda kukutana na producer, mm. akanekea beat ya kuimba. 
Afu nikaipenda. I feel like I can do something. Sasa oh, yeah. yani afu ile limitation na kusema kwamba I'm a rapper kwa sita kufanya hivi. Mm-hmm. Lakini I'm a artist mimi na na na, 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 na leta message kwa watu kupitia njia tofauti tofauti. Okay. Haina ulazima tu nichane kwa sababu nime naweza kuimba kwa nini sifanye. Mm-hmm. So but why next door ajaka kabisa kwenye kuimba ile iko middle. Okay. The flavor you can feel uh, my you know nge, 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 flavor and still you can feel uh, na naimba pia kidogo. Mm-hmm. Kwa hiko at the middle but kuimba na imba na kuchana na chana pia. Mmm mshoni lazima sana. lazima utoke mistari. Yaani <laughs> Okay so so nilichopenda by the way uh, kitu ambacho tulikuwa na what na criticize kwa female rappers wa Tanzania mm. ni mwanzoni wengi walikuwa wale wagumu kama kina Dabrat unajua mm. uh, yani uh, Eve. sasa hivi watu wamebadilika unajua Eve na Eve sasa hivi amekuwa lady yeah. kabisa yeah. 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 angalia kina Cardi B yeah. angalia kina Nicki Minaj wana ule usichana unaonekana yeah. vizuri so yeah. m- ana rap mashairi magumu lakini you can see the female side yeah. of her sio yeah. so na wewe pia naona una hiyo hata kwenye kwenye video yes. naona hiyo yani yeah. yani ule urembo wa lakisha unaonekana yeah. sio utupigie kepo simlegezo no, no, no. <laughs> gumu yo 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 I think I, I think um eh. um najaribu sana ndio nafanya uh, art ya muziki lakini najaribu sana pia kuwa mimi yes sure kwa sababu kitu ambacho ningekipenda zaidi wa Tanzania ukipata kutoka kwangu ni mimi sitaki leo nimevaa kofia kesho afu unaweza napata kofia kwenye video afu nikuta mtani nimevaa kigauno no mm. e, yaani ni vyema tu nikatokea mimi kwamba hata kokoto kaponikuta yeah. watakuta the same me sure yeah okay So, so, so b- b- kabla yote hayo nini ambacho unafanya? Uh, kabla muziki. Eh. Yeah. Au um, sasa hivi pamoja na muziki. Now uh, kwa sasa hivi um, mimi nafanya hiyo biashara. Okay. Kwa mm-hmm. shauza nguo, shauza viatu. Vitu vitu vya wasichana nilikuwa na deal deal na vya biashara za hapa na pale. Um uh, uh, pia mm. sh- mm-hmm. sh- sh- kwenye kwenye video. Ya yeah, mm-hmm. kwa Tanzania sio nyingi. Kwa Tanzania ni baadhi lakini uh, video yangu ya mwisho nilikuwa vixen kwenye video ya mkongo rice matadeni kama unajua kwa mfanya hata na na harmonize rice matadeni is from congo oh okay una nyimbo fulani fanya yeah ile ndio ilikuwa last uh, mimi kukaa kama mode kwenye video yeah so hiyo mm. uh, nao pia nilikuwa nafanya kama career kwa sababu nilikuwa napata nilikuwa nalipwa vizuri mm. yeah. okay so hiyo na biashara zangu za hapa na pale oh yeah okay so uh, nirudi kwako mima so mm. kuna una una coordinate events pia yeah. yeah. wakawaka festival ile wakawaka festival ni ni nini ya kutambie eh actually ni ni wakawaka festival is a yearly festival na tuna focus sana kwa wasanii wa Kiafrika eh ni Shelby Production actually shout out to Shelby ye yeah, actually ndo kanianzisha mm. yeah kwa sababu nakumbuka siku zile alikuwa ndo anamleta diamond kasema mi lazima niwe hapo kwa sababu huyu ni mtu wa nyumbani so akanikubalia and since then tumeanza kufanya kazi pamoja mm. yeah so tuna coordinate na wasanii tunafanya shows parties grill parties trying to like bring the african culture mm. europe eh? okay yeah right. so that's it speaking yeah. of african culture na muziki wa kiafrika mm. Sisi tuna nafasi yoyote ya mziki wa Bongo Flava. Last time nimeongea na JJ Paulo yeah. akaniambia black and white kwamba Tanzania pale bado kidogo Denmark. Yeah. Mm. Bado kidogo. Unajua kama I think unajua kama Nigeria uh, wana artist kila siku. You have to be up to date. Yeah. Na squeeze TikTok na easy reels zinatumia sana hizo nyimbo zao. Mm, sana. Yeah, so ile yani I don't know how it happened but somehow Europe na Nigeria is more capable of doing the music like in Tanzania I think we need more artists mm. yeah we need to give space for upcoming artists because kuna watu wengi wana talent nzuri sana and you never know what what exclusive wa huko watapendwa but still say we Europe is still behind like we're going there oh, yeah. say we pati nyingi pia zinaitwa afrobeat yani watu wanajaribu wenyewe kuipandisha juu yeah, yeah. Okay. so it's coming and we'll we'll make it happen yeah, okay. yeah. yeah. well ukiwa ukiwa denmark <laughs> nadhani uh, u, u, pengine unaweza kwa unaona makosa ambayo tunayafanya sisi kwenye industry ya Tanzania mm. ambayo labda ukilinganisha na Nigeria na 
mm. of course wa Nigeria zaidi ndio wanaofanya hivyo mm. kwa kufanikiwa unaweza kwa ume spot kwamba kuna mistake hii kuna mistake moja umesema kwamba hatuna wasanii wengi upcoming wakati mm. wapo hapa wapo. Yani, wapo wengi sana yes. i'm telling you yes. na kwa mimi ambaye mtu ananifuatilia atanigundua kwamba mm. nimekuwa nikipenda sana kuwapa nafasi wasanii wapya yeah. sababu napenda watoke wengi zaidi yeah. kuliko kuwapa wale wale exposure unaona mm-hmm. Uh, zaidi ya hiyo ya sisi uh, kama industry kutokuwa na nguvu ya kuwapaisha wengi zaidi uh, underground artist ni kitu gani kingine ambacho na tunakosea oh that's uh, how can i say it? i L- think ni ile ni ile eh kidogo eh no no sio hivyo sio sio kwamba wewe eh, nasema lugha sisi kwenye yeah, muziki wetu maana maybe you can unajua nigeria it, Actually no because the music it, mm-hmm. it, it just come to your heart. Okay. It doesn't matter which language. I think ni ile kuwapa wasanii wengine opportunity na ile kutizama we can all be here. Yeah. And afu unajua ukiwa wasanii wengi wanatoka Tanzania that means country pia inapanda juu. Yeah. Yeah. Tuna, watu wanakuwa more aware of oh kumbe Tanzania wana maati sawa wote. Yaani ukizama Nigeria huyu kaenda huku umalia na kuja sio kesho. Yaani mm. wako wingi sasa wanavutia ile. Sasa ile tukipata space ya kusema lakisha oh lakisha na rap. Mm-hmm. English na Kiswahili na naimba. Kuna yule anafanya hivi ina ina let something. Lakini ile kupata opportunity kuna media pia. Eh? Mm. Yeah, so I think the support. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> And also of course economy is not You, you give money to make records. Oh yeah, yeah absolutely. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Kuna talents nyingi sana ambazo haziwezi kugaramikia mm. uh, gharama za video, mavazi, kufanya yeah. kitu kizuri. So economy pia. Yeah, yeah. I mean, w- inabidi wajitokeze wada wengi zaidi wenye mm. passion na muziki yes. kusaidia hizi talents. Yeah. Na kitu kingine pia mm. nimekumbuka yani ukiwa una you're together with an artist alafu unamtafuta mtu mwingine ile utizama long run Mm. Where will this take me? So ile ah unanipa shilingi ngapi? It's not always about money. Yeah, yeah. It's about seeing a talent and seeing a director, seeing a music producer. We now work together and then you will come somewhere. Yeah, in the future. Oh, oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Mimi mama yaangalia katika jicho la nje, lakisha katika jicho la ndani wewe tuko wote hapa. Vitu gani ambavyo unaona pia vinachangia sisi tusitishe zaidi nje kwa mtazamo wako? Uh, kwa mimi mimi I mean ndo naanza kwenye muziki kwa sana experience kubwa okay. still bado najifunza na every kila siku kwenye career muziki ambao nimeichagua naendelea kujifunza kitu kipya kila siku mm-hmm. um, lakini naisangia naanza kitu ambacho mimi nakiona kinarudisha sana nyuma sisi kama wasanii ambao tunaanza kwanza okay kwanza tupewe nafasi kabisa ili mwanzo kabisa mtu akupi nafasi kabisa yani upati nafasi kabisa as long as hujulikani you have to fight so much mm. yani to the point kaka zetu i mean watu ambao umetutangulia ambao ndio wao tunawafuata tunaomba mm. lakini mtu akupi nafasi uh, kitu ambacho tena kingine akiona very very deep support mm. atupati support kabisa kwa sometimes hata unamtafuta mtu ambaye anakwambia okay ukishatoa nyimbo si lazima iwe na marketing ya mm, michezo redioni kwa mfano oh, yani una kitu unaangaika ngaika mpata kitu kidogo unamwambia wewe eh hey, naomba basi at least eh watu wanisikie kwa yule si kwa sababu tayari yuko juu radii dalili anachukua ile afu ana mute oh, ah yeah. mm. kwa ina maana ile support inakuwa haipo yani kwamba mtu tu anaangalia kile unatoa lakini end of the day atakuwa angalia ile product umeleta je mm. ii product mm-hmm. huu msichana akisikika anapata nafasi gani so oh, yeah. i think supportiwe sana sisi ambao tunaanza kwa sababu tunavunjwa sana mioyo sure. especially i mean ngoja sisimame kwa wanawake sisimame sana utaona kama unatetea sana wanawake ngoja wanawake sisi tuko watu wa oga oga kwa hiyo kitu nyima hivi tuna tunajificha ficha unaona kwa na hisi tunahitaji tu watu wa kutushika mkono watu wa kutuongoza na kutusa yani tunaomba sana support pia kwa wananchi wenyewe tunapojaribu kuangaika huku tunaandaa kitu tukikileta tunaomba kupokelewa kwa sababu wanakuambia au itajiki uwe perfect ndio uanze unahitajika uanze ili uwe mm. perfect kwa tukipata hizi chance tunaomba push sisi kama wasanii yeah, yeah I, i think umeongea kitu cha msingi sana yani naona vijana wanavyo wanavyo hustle yeah. na sometime naona wengine wakikimbilia kwetu huku ambako of course sisi 
uh, huwa ina faida zaidi pale ambapo radio zimeshampiga sana la kisha so akija hapa watu wamuone tu uh, linki kwenye bio sio ni nini mm. lakini naona uh, struggle ipo kwenye radio yeah. e, naona vijana hii una, unapataje labda airtime clouds <laughs> airtime east africa radio yeah. wasafi si wapi mm. Hiyo CD ya mawimbo kuchezwa na DJ pale hmm. ndio muziki ulipo. Ndio well, eh. Kwa sababu wananchi wanasikiza sana lilipo. Yes. Mm. Yaani wewe tukamwambia mtu yuko Morogoro au Utuliani vijijini kule ukaambia ingia YouTube. Mm, kweli. Ah, ah. Yeah. Yeah. Anasikiliza redio. Kwa ona sisi tunategemea redio wananchi watusikie. Absolutely. Mm. Eh, na okay. Kwa hiyo sisi mziki tunaofanya tu, tuna, tunafanya kuelimisha jamii, tunafanya kupeleka message kwa watu ambao wako huko experience zetu za maisha nazo pia tunaikaa kwenye muziki tuna tunahitaji ziwafikie watu. Mm. Kwa hao watu ambao wetu wako kwa tusaidie tu. Yeah. Mm. Na kama ma, ma DJ watangazaji wakiwa wana wakajiwekea uh, tuseme msimamo kwamba as long as wimbo wa msanii ni mkali awe mchanga ama ni au ni, ni, ni maarufu tutaucheza. Nadhani kuna nyimbo nyingi sana ambazo huwa nazisikia mimi lakini sijawahi kusikia zimechezwa redioni. Unaiona tu YouTube labda yeah. ina views 1000. Yeah. Yeah. Yaani watu 1000 wameangalia very good song ambayo haijulikani kabisa na mbaya zaidi ni kwamba unakuta ina miezi saba yeah. mwaka yeah. imepita hivi yeah. umeshatoka. So inauma kuona nyimbo yeah. nyingi za kupotea. Napotea mimi kama msanii nasema kitu kinapotea ambacho ni kitu ambacho mtu amechukua muda kukiandaa ameika imani yani unajua unapo mimi kama msanii sasa hivi ajalishi mbwa mtu ndio lakini yeye ninapochukua nyimbo akasema naitoa na yamini najua hii kitu ikiwafikia watu kuna kitu watakipata alafu unajikuta unapeleka ndo upate support sasa unaona yani muda unaenda alafu kila uchoko umekitegemea ukakiona kwenye akili yako ile vision inakufa wewe unavyoona alafu pia inatuvunja moyo kwa sababu kutoka pale unaza Yeah. Sasa mbona naangaika sure. eh, lakini hatutavunjika sisi tutaendelea kwa sababu unajua siku moja watu sahihi watatusikia na tutapata msaada okay. kama mm. wasanii. Okay. Mimi mama umejipangaje na challenges hizo kama manager? Unajua yani it's actually my first time yeah. Yeah, why I could manage anybody. Okay. E, lakini nimezungumza na Kisha, afu chemistry yetu iko nzuri. Mm. Na muone kama ndugu yangu pia yani hata watu wanasema tunafanana yeah. sometimes afa <laughs> actually kwa sababu eh ah yeye yeye unajua iko sana Denmark eh hata hapa kwa sababu tunafanya sasa hivi kila kitu tunafanya pamoja mm-hmm. tukote most of the time in everything kwenye muziki kwa na yeye pia anaona sasa yeah mm-hmm. she's witnessing a lot of things there ali kwenye studios mm-hmm. tunaenda hote kwenye video shows there she like she did a lot of oh. video yeah, she was there very very you know anajifunza vitu vingi mm-hmm. game yetu hapa inaendaje ni jinsi gani tunakosa nafasi yeah. ni jinsi gani tunapata nafasi ni jinsi gani tuna tunapambana tuna anaona vitu vyote as a manager anaisi ye ita ina, ina, inampa kitu kwa sisi hapa sure. ndani yeah. okay. kwa yeah. sababu yuko international wao zetu wa, wa, wanaona sana kipaji wana zingatia unajua mm-hmm. mtu anaangalia vision kubwa ya mbele lakini hapa wengi wao wanataka mm. e, kuwa ana experience na hiyo pia mm. kwa na yeye pia kama manager naona ana ana view sisi wa Tanzania na nchini hapa mziki jinsi gani unaenda na yeye kule ana aki ameni yeah. wa mwenye ukija kuziweka kwa pamoja you yeah. see the difference see the difference yeah. somewhere <laughs> Okay. Ulikuwa unaendelea. Uh-huh. Um, yeah, unajua yeah. Mefikiria kwa sababu mmefanya hii coordinating na coordinating pia unatakiwa uwe una plan kila saa unaenda wapi ufanye hivi. Sasa nikasema mekani banka sema why not nsi nsianze tu eh, kuwa manager ni nianze na lakisha na tumeona chemistry nzuri and then I just jump out of it. Yaani tumekutana one month ago. Yeah. Mm. Na tushafanya music video, yeah. tusha yani there's so many things with so many people. Eh. Yeah. Mm. Lakini ile kusema kwa mention ile unajua industry hii ya music is male dominated. So pia ukiwa mshana yani lazima uwe straightforward, u observate vitu, mm. yani you see? So there's many challenge in that uh, part that we need to know how to navigate this uh, now industry. ukizingatia msanii ni mwanamke manager mwanamke exactly. kwa hiyo na kwa sababu tena muziki wenyewe umetawaliwa na wanaume kwa hiyo challenge ni double lakini naamini kwa sababu talent it. ipo yes uh, mtafanikiwa yeah. ulisema kwamba baada ya kuripost mwanzoni mm. wimbo wake uh, producers wa kibao wa Denmark wakasema who is this yes. afu unajua unajua wasanii wetu wakubwa mm. Denmark ni wa Tanzania 
imagine aliniambia kwa jiji Paulo yeah. aliniambia kwa mfano king, king uh, uh, nani um, kaka ka, king, kaka kaka wafande kesi al, 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 wote was, na hiyo ni kwa ba Denmark nzima Denmark nzima na ni wa Tanzania yes wow. yani wale na wajua tangu wadogo kwa sababu Denmark ni small wewe umeenda umeenda mwaka gani sasa hivi na miaka 30 Si umezaliwa huko kwa ulizaliwa. Umeenda mdogo sana. Yeah, mdogo. Yeah, mdogo sana. Miaka mingi. Sita tano. Okay. Yeah. So so you know, Danish unaongea fluent. Fluent, yeah. Oh. Lakini unajua mamangu alisema ukiwa nyumbani unazungumza Kiswahili. Oh yeah. Kwa nje unajua. Yeah. So ile ime ndio maana hoja kisahau. Mm. Malaika ingekaa hapa kila kilisha na wasema. Ndio kuna angaika sana kwenye interview kwanza. Yeah, so. Okay. Yeah, lakini ndio hiyo. Yaani afu pale nikaona okay tuna wa Tanzania big artist Denmark labda ni wa connect mm. afu huyo mmoja alivompenda huyu ni ni producer na group yake na hiyo kuna group kuna wa Tanzania wawili half wa Danish wa Tanzania mm. sasa huyo mmoja anaitwa Tarik anataka kufanya ni bona like kisha wao wana rap oh. yeah so nikaona why not nianze ku connect wasanii wa Tanzania na wasanii wa, wa, wa Denmark mm. so, ile tusaidiane yeah. Afu unajua ndio ile labda ndio itafanya music ya kitanzania inaenda Europe. Yeah. Kwa sababu kule ndio wanasikiliza Danish music. So utukifanya collaboration huku tutajulikana pia. Oh yeah. yeah. Okay. So uh, ngoma hii imesema inatoka March. Yeah, first. Mm-hmm. Tale moja. Tale moja. Mm-hmm. So tutashia na wewe vile vile ngoma hiyo ikitoka ili uweze yeah. kusikia. Mimi nimeonjeshwa exclusively <laughs> yes. kipande cha yes. video hii and I'm telling you ni lakisha ana kitu amekuja kuchukua pesa yake. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Kaja kuchukua pesa yake. Lakisha mm-hmm. nani unamkubali rapper Tanzania? Tanzania Conboy. Oh okay nimekulimit nime, nime nimekuambia uh, female peke yake lakini nimependa jibu lako so tuwe general so in general unampenda conboy conboy ana ana ah, ana balaa eh yeah i swear uh, ile nyimbo yake i'm gonna do the shit till i die uh, yeah yeah that's an inspirational song i love it mm-hmm. like yeah yeah namkubali sana conboy napenda jinsi anafanya okay um naweza kaongeza yes sure <laughs> country boy uh oh. Um, Lunya mhm ah kwa wanake na sinapenda wengi lakini uh, kidogo Frida oh Frida yeah, yeah. Mm. I like the right wako wengi mm-hmm. wako wengi sana sasa so, tutamaliza mm-hmm. no inatosha yeah. Yeah. inatosha so 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 mima inabidi afanye kila analoweza kwenye project zinazokuja combo ya wepo kwa sababu unajua mtaua sana alikujibu kwa sababu kuna one time niweingia live instagram mm-hmm. uh, mimi sina mashabiki wengi kwa sababu ndo naanza na vi, watu vi, na vi, watu vyao mm-hmm. mm-hmm. wao wananifuatilia wenyewe na wanakuamini yeah. yeah. yes. yani kuna nyimbo niki nikiingia niki, niki, wanaambia sasa hapa kai conboy hapa nami nikubali ah. kama hapa nikaanza kuonya wao na mtext conboy ah. kuna lakisha na mimi nikam text hello sema janijibu okay. i hope ataona okay. conboy nime yeah. kuna DM <laughs> yangu kwenye simu yako ah, basi tuhakisha ujumbe huu kon, kona bizo unamfikia aitwa kona bizo yake nyingine okay ndugu yetu huyo so ni tunamweza unaona so itapendeza sana guys mimi nimefurahi sana kuongea na nyinyi hapa nategemea makubwa kutoka kwenu asante popote pale mtakapo kuhitaji support kutoka SNSC tupo kwa ajili ya support talents au sio as long as ni talents kweli kweli mm. au vipi asante so so uh, nilisema kwamba siwezi nikakuacha la kisha pasipo kukupa time utupe bars mm. au <laughs> tupe bars bana uh, kwa sababu zone hajapata nafasi sana anyway hiyo ni tokea kwa kwanza ya zone ya kwanza akipata <laughs> nafasi zone kama watu wengi sana walipata kuisikia aha uh-huh. ulitoa so, video Yeah ina video iko YouTube. So, oh, okay so nitakuwekea nitakuwekea link kwenye yeah. description hii. Okay, okay tupe hiyo kidogo. Yeah I go hard. Swiss poor come weak. Game iko tough la league. And since I'm the boss at mchiza kini to out I'm a pay a bill for a nigga. And I'm dripping so hard babe. Na she take over speedy ko want it. Afunone kana kama najisikia et na kunipata no where is too late. Well. Mm. Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Utamu mwingine 
zaidi utaupata kwenye video nzima. Yeah. So umemshirikisha mtu mapanche? Ya, yeah, ya, yeah. mm. kwenye zone yuko mapanche amefanya chorus. Um, okay. Yeah, hii pili imefanya mwenyewe. Mm. Yeah. Um, Krabus kuziko zinakuja. Oh yeah. yeah. Yeah, interesting. Mimi macha mwisho ungependa kusema nini? Well, I'm, just, um, I'm happy we met up time. Mm. Yes, cuz like we said like it's the support that we need. Yeah. And it's it's beautiful kuona watu wana wanachukua time yao, unajua uko busy, lakini unachukua time una broadcast the yes. artist. Yeah. So thank you very much. And uh, we're going to come harder. Oh yeah. Yes. All the best. <laughs> Kila laheri. So so Instagram unatumia jina gani? Uh, Instagram unatumia lakisha dot tz. Nilikuwa na account mwanzo eh. Mm. Lakini wakanifungia Instagram kidogo. Oh, ni post ni. Eh. Ko <laughs> lakini jina liko vile lakisha ile ina underscore ya mwanzo ambayo imepotea lakini ya sasa hivi ni lakisha dot tz. Mhm. Alafu uh-huh. picha yangu iko pale icon ya black and white. Mm-hmm. Eh, uh-huh. like uh, Instagram, uh, Facebook, YouTube na copy ukitaka kuangalia nyimbo zangu unaandika lakisha tz. Hivyo hivyo inakuja page yangu pale. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Okay. Mimi f- uh, the flower Instagram. Mima, eh? Mima, the flower. Mima, Mima, yeah. the flower. It's actually my daughter's name. Oh. Yeah, yeye anaitwa Fahima. Mm-hmm. But uh, na mimi namuita Mima. Mm. So it's Mima the flower. Oh Mima yeah. the flower. Lakini yeah. ndio jina ambalo wengi wanakuita hivi au. Yeah, yani hapo hapa hapa ni Mima tu. Oh yeah. 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 Denmark. No, Denmark Kalisa. Kalisa. Mm. Oh, kwa huko unaitwa Kalisa. Eh. Mm. Nikwambia hilo jina si tu kilisikia mashabiki wa Game of Thrones. Kumbuka yeah. <laughs> Mother Dragon. Kalisi. Ka- Kalisi. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Well, asante sana kwa uh, muda wenu guys kila laheri na March 1st ngoma itakapotoka tutaishare pia kwa uh, wana SNS hapa ku enjoy kila ambacho lakisha mkifanya. Frederick Bundala Skywalker ndio jina langu uh, next time kwa Heidi. Asante kwa nafasi. Karibu tena. Yeah.